With the AI Smart Home app, controlling your Denali Air Quick Connect Mini Split is easier than ever. Today, we'll show you how to set up your app as well as go over some of its unique features to help you get the most out of your mini split. Part 1 Connecting the app and the unit. Once you've successfully created a profile and signed into the app, select the plus icon at the top right corner of the Devices tab to add a new device. To set up your mini split, select Air Conditioner. Once at this screen, use your mini split's remote control to put the remote in pairing mode. Press the horizontal swing button, this one, six times, making sure to separate each button press. When the unit beeps five times and its display flashes 77, you can continue pairing the app. Next, press the set Wi-Fi button to take you to your phone's settings app. Go to the Wi-Fi tab and select the new Wi-Fi signal starting with HiSmart. Once you're connected, return to the app. The app will begin scanning for available wireless networks to pair the unit to. Select a signal and enter the password and the app will pair itself to the unit. Set the unit's name and now your unit will be paired to the app. Part 2. Device With the AI Home app, you can control your mini split even without the use of the remote. The app has three tabs, Devices, Intelligence, and Profile. From the Devices tab, you can turn the unit on and off with this switch. Tap on the unit and you have access to a wide variety of functions. You can change the unit's mode between Fan Only, Dry, Auto, cool, and heat. You can rotate the dial in the center clockwise to turn the unit's temperature up, and rotate counterclockwise to turn it down. You can use the options below to change the unit's fan speed. Set the unit's sleep mode. Set the unit's air vent to swing vertically. Turn fast heating or cooling on or off. Turn quiet mode on or off. Turn energy saver mode on or off. And change the unit's temperature to be displayed in Celsius or Fahrenheit. Part 3. Intelligence. From the Intelligence tab, you can program the unit to perform complex functions that would normally need to be done manually with the remote. Tap the Add button or the Plus button in the corner to set a new function. Next, enter a name for the function and select an icon that will be used to represent it. You can choose any of the nine icons you want. For this example, I chose the name Sleep and the Bed icon. Next, you'll need to set up an if-then statement for the function. On the if page, you'll select the conditions under which the unit will perform the function. Manual execution will set a function that only activates when you press the button in the app. Timer will set the unit to activate at a certain time of day and devices will have specific functions based around your device, in this case, the mini split. For this example, I've set the unit to activate at 8 a.m. every day. Please note that the time is set to military time. Next, on the then page, select the unit you want to control, and the app will give you several programmable options. You can choose to turn the unit on or off, set the unit's mode, fan speed, and temperature. I've set the unit to turn on in cool mode with auto fan speed at 65 degrees. Tap the save button in the upper right hand corner and now, at 8am every day, the unit will turn on and activate in the settings I've programmed. Experiment with various functions to program your mini split to operate as efficiently as possible. Part 4. Profile. From the Profile tab, you can change your personal information and app settings. Press the Personal Center button and you can change your username, password, and profile picture. You can use the Message Center to access any messages from other users. Device Management lets you change the settings of your devices, including the device name and location, as well as share it with other app users. Share Management lets you manage who can control your units with their app. Presentation mode lets you show off the functions of the unit without controlling the unit directly. Finally, the Settings button allows you to customize the app's use of push notifications, which language is displayed, clear the app's cache, and read up on its technical specs. Now that you understand how to use your AI Smart Home app, 
controlling your Denali Air Mini Split will be easier than ever. Thanks for watching, and for all your other HVAC needs, check back with us right here at Denali Air.